Hey guys, really quick five minute video on how to make jewelry. You are going to need some diamond glaze, some E6000, uh, a jewelry holder and the glass bezel that goes on top and a skin. Now how you make your skins is completely up to you. What you wanna do on the skin is find where a good place, a good focal point, uh, you want to put your glass bezel and that's what your jewelry will look like. So once you've found that, what you'll do is take your glass bezel and put a few drops of the diamond glaze in the center of the bezel. Now it's important to put enough so that when you put that glass down on the skin, that glue is going to spread and completely cover the glass bezel. It kind of serves as uh, a, like a resin effect. It really enhances the colors the way that resin does. It brings out the sparkle. And like I said, it, it looks just like you've resined it. Now, if you've done it correctly, you're gonna have some uh, overflow on the glue, which is fine, just wipe it up. Try not to get any on top of the glass. Sometimes I do. And if, if you wipe it off really quick, it'll be fine. If it happens to dry later, um, you, all you can do is just take your razor blade and just gently scrape it off. It comes right off. So you're gonna wait about five to 10 minutes for it to dry. And once it's dried, come back with your scissors and cut it out. Now you want to use that glass bezel as a, uh, oh, what's the word? I can't think of the word. As a support, I guess, a stabilizer for your scissors. Just cut as close to the glass as you possibly can. Now this is a heart, so I'm not gonna be able to get that uh, little top indention on the heart. But that's okay. I'm pressing down on it just to make sure it's totally, totally dry. I did this pretty quick. So then what you're gonna do is just take a razor blade and if I'll get into the screen where you can see, again, you're gonna use that glass bezel as a base for your razor blade. Just slice right along the base of the glass kind of at an angle from the back of it so that you don't, uh, it, if you don't do it just right, you'll tend to kind of rip, rip off the skin. So do it from the back and cut towards the front and just use the glass as a base uh, to kind of slide your razor blade along. And be very careful and don't cut yourself we love color, but we don't love blood in our videos. So just be very, very careful while you're doing this. Now, once that's done, I'm gonna give it a little polish here in just a second. There we go. Make sure I don't feel anything. If there's glue on it, you're gonna feel it. So there we go. So take your jewelry holder and you're going to take your E6000 and all you need is a little dab in the center of it. That's it. This stuff is the best adhesive I have ever, ever found. Put your glass bezel in on top. If you need to center it, center it. Some of these uh, jewelry holders have just a tiny, tiny, tiny little bit of space. So center it if you need to. Press down on it really hard and walk away from it, let it dry. It's dry in about 10 minutes and you're good to go. And ta-da. And these were a couple of uh, pieces that I have actually just done the past couple nights. Love those colors, love how the, the light catches them. Just beautiful, that's part of my Ocean series. And then that is part of my Harvest Moon series. 
Hope you learned something. Hope I was able to help you. Please let me know if you have any questions. I'm here for you.